Hey guys, welcome to our YouTube channel. Today we are going to solve our skill track daily challenge using Python programming language. Before going to logic, if you didn't subscribe to our channel, then subscribe right now and make our work more meaningful. First we understand our question. The program has to accept the string yes as the input and then convert this string yes to integer x and then the unique alphabets are denoted in x from the from the least significant bit to most significant bit the alphabets in s are denoted by set bits of 1 Finally, the program must print the decimal equivalent of the binary string. So first, we have to accept the string yes and convert this string yes. to integer x and then the unique alphabets are denoted in x from the least significant bit to the most significant bit so after that the alphabets in s are denoted by set bits of 1 and finally the program was print the decimal equivalent of the binary string so for example in this we have to arrange the alphabets like a a will be at the last and then followed by b c d e f g h i j k l m n o p q r s t u v w x y z so this will be the order and if we have any character then zero will be changed to one so for example if we have if the string yes contain a means then here the zero will be changed to one so similarly we are going to solve our test case now in this test case we have skill rack as our string so for yes will change it so for near s this zero will be changed to 1 and we have k here also will be changed to 1 and then for i and then for l and then again we have l so it remains same so and then we have r and then we have a that we already did and then we have c and then we have k which is already done so this binary value will be converted to a decimal value so we must convert it to the decimal so the decimal equivalent of this binary value will be 3 and this will be our output now we'll take our another test case so in this test case we have a b c d so here a b c d will be converted to 
so a here it is 1 and then for b it is 1 and then for c it is 1 and then for d we'll have 1 so this binary value will have a decimal value and that is 15 so 15 will be our output now let's see how to solve this program so first we have to get the string s as the input and then we are having the integer x equal to 0 then we have to convert this integer x to the required format so here we are accessing each index of the string s by iterating over a for loop and here we have blank which must be filled by us so as you know these are the set units and if there is any character then we add this must be changed to one so if we have a means then one left shift operator is zero and then if we have b means it is one left shift operator one so what does one left shift operator zero mean is this will be changed to one and what is one left shift operator one means is this character near to b will be changed to one and if there is one left shift operator two then the c will be changed to one and then if we have z means it is one left shift operator 25 so that's how it goes and then the next thing you have to understand is the ascii value so if the ascii value of a is 97 then it must be subtracted with 97 to get 0 so in the same way the ascii value of b is 98 and it must be subtracted by 97 to get 1 so it goes on so here we'll have x or and then here we'll have str of index minus 97 so here it is one left shift operator so as i said if we have and string like AB then here A will be changed to 1 and then B will be changed to 1 and this binary value will contain a decimal value so it must be then converted to decimal so this one left shift operator will give us the required output.